Well, that pen is one of the most talked about in baseball history. I mean, you guys, everyone talked about you guys were tough, nasty, crazy. You were winners. What's the best nasty boy story you can share with us on air? <laughs> well, I mean, there's a lot of them. We had a lot of fun. Uh, you know, not only was it the three of us on that team that did a lot of things together, uh, it, it was our whole team. Um, you know, I, we could talk about stories about Randy sitting in the locker room reading his newspaper uh, with a machete and a you know, <laughs> block of cheese and a machete. And he said he used a machete to cut the cheese. <laughs> but you, know, you come near him, he take a swipe at you. I don't think he's trying to cut anybody's leg off, but you know that was the kind of the mystique. And uh, remember, there was one time in uh, Philadelphia, Larry Rothschild, uh, pitching coach for the Yankees, now was our bullpen coach. Mm-hmm. And, uh, they had an electric garage door that kind of led into the back of the stadium. Mm-hmm. Uh, it went pretty high up in the air, and I remember there was one time that I uh, hit the up button, and Randy and Rob and myself, all three were holding on to it. Uh, you know, we were, I don't know, 16, 15, 12, 20 feet in the air, holding on to that garage door. Like, okay, you guys can let us down now. <laughs> all, all of the concrete, all wearing our spikes, and Larry was kind of having a conniption fit, thinking, guys, good God, if one of these guys falls and gets hurt on my watch, then it might cost him my job. So, <laughs> you know, we did a lot of stuff like that. We we we, we played the game really hard, and we were really intense uh, in the things we did. Uh, but not for one instant did we ever come to the ballpark not anticipating having fun that day.